Friday moments for a family in Pomona. A man was shot nine times and survived, but some of those bullets got inside a home and almost hit three children playing inside. CBS News' Kara Finstrom is live in Pomona, where police are still looking for the shooters at this hour. Kara, what do you have for us? Well, DeMarco, the man suffered critical injuries when he was shot repeatedly outside of that home. Amazingly, though, we are told now that he is in stable condition. Some good news there. Investigators are also working to identify and find the shooters, and neighbors tell us they're worried. Well, anyone could have been shot. It could have been our house. It could have been our neighbors. This man, who didn't want to be identified, lives near the Pomona house where three shooters opened fire last night. A man in his 40s standing outside was shot nine times. Other bullets flew into the home, barely missing three children and two other adults. Minimum 20 bullets. It was about a 15 second uh, shooting spree. The neighbor's security camera recorded the shooting. He didn't want the video shown while the investigation is underway, but we are able to let you hear the rapid gunfire. And here's how the neighbor described what the video captured. He was outside, not even looking towards the street. Car pulls up. Everyone got out. Driver, passenger, and one person in the back seat. Like they got out of the vehicle to physically catch up to him, shoot him at close range, and the victim ran off. Investigators say bullets were found in the wall right above where three children had been playing video games. Fortunately, neither them nor the other adults inside were hurt. Other neighbors tell us a woman and her two children live here. They're unsure of their relationship with the man who was shot. Like and detectives just told us they believe the car involved is a Dodge Charger. DeMarco, they also say they're looking into whether this may be related to gang activity, but say the motive is not clear yet.